Hey stewards, we're here in Kisumu, uh, right behind the beautiful 90 hills, right? And I was surprised to come here today. Uh, we're working on a sugarcane project and to see all of the slash and burn that's going on here. We've kind of already passed it on the bodas, but there's just lots of uh, crop residue that's being burned off uh, in this direction. And you can actually see it's, it's uh, polluting the air and clouding the hills. But more than just affecting our lungs and the air quality, we're also burning away a free resource. Uh, that biomass can be turned into carbon, it can be turned back into the soil or turned into biochar and, and benefit these plantations. But currently, with what's going on, it is very convenient uh, for farmers to just desiccate the land with the burning, uh, which, is, which is understandable when you need to quickly get rid of the stubble. Um, but this is, this is ripe for opportunity in the sense of um, microbials that break down biomass or, or using this uh, to get it back into the soil or to compost in some way to reintroduce it back into the earth instead of introducing it to the atmosphere. And I just, I can't explain the beauty out here. It's so peaceful. And it, it's, it's a strange uh, feeling to be in a place like this that's so peaceful and then, and then yet to be having all of this burning going on. So it's a large contrast. So you can see out here fields that are getting ready. This is getting ready for the rains, right? Getting ready for the rains. Our lovely boat is that we're riding around on today. And some cane that's getting close. Would you say this is close? Yeah. Over here is what did you say that was? Kenyan research? Kenya research. Kenya sugar research. Kenya sugar research. So, this is a really interesting area of Kisumu that we're going to be getting some more work going on in. Uh, but I just wanted to show you the, the, the scenery out here, but also the, the first thing that I noticed as well uh, if we could find a good way that's good for the farmers and still convenient to turn that biomass into resources instead of wasting it and create a more efficient system that builds the soil. And then what was the synthetic thing you said they plant with? DAP fertilizers. DAP. If we could find a way to introduce fertility and soil health separate to that, the farmers who don't burn are gonna to start to see an increase and will incentivize a different way of doing this. And we're gonna work with the farmers to see what we can do. Sasa. So, uh, yeah, I'll try to keep some updates coming. Uh, if you guys have any questions, let me know. Thank you. Thank you.